Alright, what is up? We're playing we're in the middle of playing Golden Arena mode. And I just kinda like this. It's not like abyss mode. It's like, it's not heavy. Oops, I hit the did the wrong stuff again. Hang on, Coromaru, come back. What the that was a mistake. I'm still working on the combo. That's what I wanted to do. Still working on my combos though, still working on my news, still working on everything. Yeah, slowly getting better. Slowly starting to realize that uh <laughs> I got a lot of work to do. But um I don't know man, Ken's not really Ken's not messing with me like I like um um I picked him because he had Koromaru and because he used a spear, like no other reason. Didn't know anything about his gameplay, didn't know anything about his style. And Ken is very much a beat the shit out of your opponent at neutral kind of character. He's not, he's the kind of character that you get a light lead with and then you hover around at about this range. And then you just make people make mistakes when they try to get past you. Hit the wrong button again! Did the wrong thing again? Did the wrong thing again? Did the right thing to I mean, my biggest thing right now in regards to like. like in regards to, well, firstly, obviously, combos. I don't have them down 100%. I know a few of them off of various confirmed. Like, it's basic B&B &B is the one that I keep screwing up now, but that one that I kind of did, uh, where you do the pullback into the knockdown with the A version, and then you do um, quarter circle 236D with Koromaru, and then he picks them up, sends them along, then you do 236B, pull them back with Ken, and then off of that you can do 2B, and then an aerial thing, and then after that you can also follow up with, I haven't, I haven't done this successfully once, um, but, cause like I figured that part out myself up to there, and then I look, after that, after I figured, no, like, okay, this is the best combo I've found, let me look at what other people have found, and let me see, uh, you know, how I can improve this, and it turns out you can do, you can, with the proper timing, uh, do another Koromaru hit off of his J2B when you knock them back down to the ground, and then you can land and do um, uh, his his um, I don't know his DP whatever it's called Vile Assault. You can do Vile Assault and get the knockdown off that, and then you can do a super after Vile Assault if you so desire. Um, but anyway, uh, the reason why I like this mode is because firstly it's not as uh, impactful on your character to improve statistics like this like this increases XP earned that's nothing increases burst gauge increments cool increases HP cool increases amount of SP gain cool this is the only one that'll really kind of like potentially fuck you up like you may get a skewed uh, s view of how much damage your character can do but it's not like um, blaze blue where you know it's gonna be fucking up your it's gonna be speeding up your air dashes it's going to be giving you additional jumps, it's gonna be speeding up ground dashes, like, you know, it's not gonna fuck you up as badly if you try to pick your main character and utilize them in abyss mode, and this one, it's, it's nowhere near as bad, and let me actually see, what are these, I can't, I can't go down and check, that's kinda lame that I can't go down, and look at that stuff, so I'll go ahead and do that, I can't look at the, what the skills do, opponent starts with less HP, okay, I don't know what Super Kazu does though, Wait, I like this. This is very cool. This is very interesting. It's much better than Abyss mode. So I'm actually going to be doing this instead of using Arcade mode to work on my combos right now. Like, you know, I cannot do... The main thing that I have with Ken right now, Koromaru is very much a neutral tool. Neutral and combo-based tool. It does. I'm not really seeing much of a prospect for him being like particularly good for... Um, Oh, I did it! Ow. 
調子乗ってるよこれからですどうしたらいいかいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいざいMaster. I want to do my throw combo. Yay! Like that. I could have done something off of that. I said, no, I didn't. I think you need to do um, his spinny attack. You need to do his spinny attack. And then it keeps them on the ground, and then you can pick them up and send them flying away. But yeah, I, need, I have a lot of work to do. Obviously. Oh, I leveled up again. Do you level up after every single. Chance of mute when attack hits. Oh, so I think I stole that off of Junpei. Show me the ultimate fight! Yeah, I'm definitely not really, um... Um... I'm getting used to Persona again. I keep, like, a lot of the times I press the impress button. What? Auto combo. I did it again. Like that, I keep, I keep meaning to do. Oops. I keep meaning to do. Crouching, uh, or not. I keep meaning to do 2C, like 2C, anything C. And then I end up doing it, pressing D instead, which D summons Koromaru. Which obviously I don't want to be doing. I would rather prefer to keep Koromaru around. But I definitely, I need to figure out, because now that I'm actually, now that I've actually got the necessary muscle memory, um, to kind of do this combo, I need to be trying to extend it to the best of my ability. But it's just to give you a little bit of hint how where I'm at right now. I'm not. I haven't done a lot of work. Unfortunately, I was kind of in that. I don't know how many of you guys have experienced this, but kind of that mode where like you're playing something, but you just don't really. You can apply to anything. You're doing anything, and like, it just doesn't stick. What you're doing is just, you can't focus properly, you'll take color. And so like, you know, you finish doing something for like five minutes, and you're just like, what, are the, what the hell did I just work on? I'm honestly not sure. Oh, see, see what I mean, like that kind of shit, that was way too late. Model combo go. Oops. Ah! I need to figure out how to, cause he can combo off of that normally too. He can hit us. Uh, he can hit 5B off of his normal bro. And I need to figure out how to combo off of that just in case Koromaru's dead. Or um, I mean, obviously it, it is a growing pain. I gotta learn all my proper confirms and. I am taking the hard route. Obviously, you know, this game is... Well, actually, Ken doesn't really qualify for that because Ken is console version exclusive. Um, so, Ken has not been able, to, been capable of being played for almost half a year, over a year. I don't know how long it's been since this game came to arcades. So, there isn't that level of experience, but people still have a month more. Oh, he came in with the spear. That's adorable. Um, people have had more experience with Ken than me. A month to figure this shit out themselves. But, I would... Yeah, I need. I, I have like I have good confirms off of normal hits, but off of like throws, I don't have optimal confirms off of um, aerial hits. Would be another one. I don't have optimal confirms off of that.
Are you ready? I really like this combo, but like, oh, Like, Ken's one of those characters that he just kind of, he has those kind of combos that I like to see. I guess I really like the aesthetic. Here. No, I want to kill the throw. This. They're getting clever with it. This is I gotta give them props for this. It's just getting started. Are you ready? Oh god, he chased me down. Oh, I did not go down. Ha! I'm a fraud. Damn it! Stay patient. Oh. That's one disadvantage. Like, that's it. That's it. Obvious. Oh shit, I fucked up. I fucked up again. Ah! Do it. Fire! That's one thing I need to apply to my game too. I never finish with the super. But that, obviously that gives me that gives me good damage afterwards. I need to be, I need to be using it. It's too bad like this mode, I mean it's hysterical slap is that chance of rage. I can't even remember what rage does. Oh, what is super cop? Increases speed. Get rid of that. Let us get rid of that so I do not get any kind of poor impression of my proper speed and whatnot. But yeah, I mean, I, I have to assume these characters probably, it's probably a variable. Like, each character may get different skills, which is awesome. I really, I, I'm really liking the effort put into this. Oh, somebody tell me story mode. What do you get for beating Story Mode? Like, it was worth it in Chrono Phantasm, because you unlock Kagura if you beat... Um, Sonya. I really feel like this is just an absolute... Oh, wow. But yeah, it's... It feels so easy with Ken to Persona Break Elizabeth. I feel like that's a terrible just because it's so easy to hit the Nautilus. I just want to keep getting more and more XP. I don't care about anything else. All of the XPs. Like that kind of thing, he's good for Oki. I should have mentioned that. He's good for Oki. I could have done super after that to guarantee the death. Like, Ken has good damage. This hit, which is great. Uh, he has a lot of functionality. I haven't 
tested it, but it seems like he's got a lot of good functionality with the uh, SP version. That was what they call it. I think the SP version of that special move. Very fast. It's basically like the A version is fast, but it doesn't have very much range. B version is slower startup, but it has a ton more range. It goes probably, I'd say, about 80% of the screen. And then the SP version is in the middle of that. But much faster. I think it might actually even be faster than the A version. Are you ready? But it definitely seemed like. Yeah, keep doing that. Keep doing that. Like, I've heard people. I think that was close, actually. Um. I've heard people who've had problems doing double quarter circles in this game. Whereas, me personally. I am getting too many double quarter circles. That happens. I don't know why that happens so often, but I get double quarter circles a lot. And I don't want to. Are you ready? That's my one. Oops. I'm very bad because I feel like you should be able to get me. Damn it. I feel like you should be able to get me. Damn. Jesus, now I'm fucking it up all the time. From crouching B to standing B. Not from crouching B, from cr uh, 2A to 5A. I keep alternating between using numbers and just saying crouching. Shoutouts to my consistency. But it really feels like you should be able to Gatling from 2A to 5A with Ken, but you can't. You need 2A, you have to go into a B move. And so that's something I definitely need to work on and improve. Oh god, Koromaru went off. Oh no, where Koromaru went off too. Man, I'm all over the place in regards to like what I want to say. Never with punt, never with Ken. I feel like there's nothing worse than whiffing with this character. It's like his standing A, his 5A. God, be consistent, son. His, um, his 5A has a surprising amount of recovery for an A button. Would, I would not... I'm definitely quite surprised by how much... Press start to recover. Oh, that's kind of cool. I kind of like that. That's pretty cool. And like his standing B, if you, if you, uh, I'll just, I'll show it to you. I'll run away from Miss Nauto. Miss Shadow Nauto. But he throws out, he, you know, stabs with it. And instead of just pulling back, he twirls the, he twirls the spear. 
Yeah, the spear. And so thanks to that extra little twirl there. Ah. This is long enough. I think this is long enough. Oh, long enough. Right, so I'm gonna do one match. more, one more match here on camera, and then I'll be done. Because I'm sure this is getting repetitive. I don't really have, you know. I mean, this is this is learning a fighting game. It's all very repetitive. God damn, what a hideous color. Oh, I see. I'm not recovering health. Did I do it? Did I get health back? I don't know if I got health back. I didn't know he got body. Oh, right. Really surprising, though, how very little purpose their personas have. I mean, it's obvious Koromaru is basically kind of supposed to take over the functionality of what they would normally do, so I'm gonna up my health a little bit, because I'm getting my health. Um, but yeah, the only normal move Ken's Persona, actually, I think... So Ken's Persona, I believe, has one normal attack follow-up to a spear grab, and then he does one super, uh, which is the spear twirling shit. That you've seen me do my mistake. Kuromaru, I think his only persona attack is actually fire. The fire super. And that's it. And then I think both personas take part in his awakening super. Ah, it didn't work. Thought that worked. Screwing everything up. Screwing everything up. Alright, so that will be the last match. This will be the last match. I have so much to work on.